We're rolling. Rolling? Mm-hmm. Welcome back to the taste tour. <laughs> she hasn't worn I a shirt since like, she's been here. I don't like starting with videos. Well, you said you'd this do it. Is, <laughs> well, this is Vera Moretti Limon. It is a Rodler, 2% alcohol. So a lemon Rodler, basically. Can you get the zoom in on that? <laughs> I'm just so boring, that's why I don't like starting. Yeah, we know. <sighs> All right. <laughs> it much for you? It's a bit much. A bit much, okay. It tastes like lemonade. Yeah? It doesn't even taste like... I think these are both supposed to be like the equivalent of mites. Like Except mites different. are at least 5%. Well, I don't know. Try it. All right. Ready for the swap? It smells good. I don't think this one's as bad as the one. No. It just tastes like lemon soda. Pretty much. Let's see if I can. Mm hmm. Yep. Okay. I mean, it's basically something, from my perspective, to cool you down on a really hot day. Yeah. The thing is, for me, I don't like real sugary stuff to do that. I'm, I prefer more watery stuff to do that. Um, this one I think is better than the lime one. I think I'd give this like a six. And I think. I don't mean to say that these are bad, because they're not bad. I think, actually, if you like the way we're describing them, you would like them. It's just not what I want right now, and it's not... They have a good flavor in general, I would say. Just not exactly what I want out of one of these drinks. Yeah. But I think if you like the idea of it, of a, of a low alcohol, sweet, almost soda-esque, uh, lemon or lime-flavored drink, you'd probably like it. Yeah. So I'm going to give it a six. Even the five and a half. So, as she forgot to say, we are at the Piazza Navona in Rome. Oh, yeah. And the tip off taste will return, whether from here or elsewhere. So, stick around and join us for those who are in the beer already in the morning. And it's a, uh, a nice little uh, beverage, but not exactly my style, but pretty nice. Little. So, we'll be back. Thank you. So, we're at the Trevi Fountain at night. Well, dusk. And, uh, yeah, you know, it's it's quite beautiful, but uh, let me tell you something. Let me show you the crowds here. Here's the crowd. So, it's pretty insane for a fountain. The fountain's pretty, but I don't know that it's that pretty. So here's a little 4K video at night of the Colosseum in uh, Roma. Um, I'm shooting this with the uh, Sony, uh, <laughs> the, the, the Sony RX100 IV model, the Mark IV, if you will, that's what they call it. And um, just kind of trying out the night mode. It looks pretty good on the screen, but who knows how it's actually going to turn out. So. I know the panning is not real great with this camera, so just let me know how it turns out. So here's another shot of the Coliseum with the Sony RX, whoop, that was wobbly, RX uh, 100 Mark IV camera, shooting this in 4K. 4K video is good on this camera, just the um, stabilization is very, very difficult. Um, much better with the 
camcorder, even though the sensor is a lot smaller. That's why I use this one for night. Ugh, God, keeping this still is so hard. But anyway, enjoy the view.